grind hard to get ahead. You trying to go backwards. Feelings from the past, pray the Lord block it all out. I was in love with you. Bye, y'all. Boy, Kevin Two Turn coming again with another motherfucking video. Bruh. Bruh, 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 bruh. I was just talking about yesterday. How, you know what I'm saying? I, I ran away from the crib for the first time ever, which is never really happened. Nigga, nigga never really had a chance to run from, run away from the crib because I always got kicked out. You did. But this day, it was different. But, I met my homeboy Mario dad up in that bitch. Walking down the street, I'm telling y'all niggas, bro. Um, really from the hood, north side shit. You know what I'm saying, bro? But I don't even want to talk about none of that shit, bro. Cause I good seeing my homeboy dad for the first time in like forever. Cause you know what I'm saying. When I when I went to to Austin and shit, I I, I was telling him, I said, oh, there was a chance that I might not even, I, I was gonna even come back to this bit, but I came back. But, that's not what I want to fucking talk about. Fuck all that other shit. Bruh. When I tell you. When I fucking tell you. Nate Robinson. Nate Robinson. Motherfucking Nate Robinson. Bruh. If y'all don't know who Nate Robinson is, bruh. This nigga was a professional basketball player. He killed it in basketball, bruh. He was by like what five eight or something. Nigga was like five eight five and nine, legally a midget. Nigga was shorter than me, dunking on niggas. Yes, this nigga was in the NBA, five eight five nine, dunking on niggas. How? I don't know. I don't know how. This nigga was literally too legit. Like Julian Newman. Julian Newman should have looked at um Nate Robinson game because they this a high chance Julian Newman might not make it to the, the NBA, but they, he should like I said he should look at Nate Robinson game, not his fighting skills. No 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 no. This motherfucker here, bruh. Okay, I've been I've been hearing about this. I've been hearing about um Nate Robinson and Jake Paul. They were supposed to be having a little boxing match and. Um, Mike, Mike, and Roy Joe, Mike Tyson, and Roy Joe Jr. or whoever the fuck that nigga is, having a fight. Okay, I don't know when a fight was gonna happen. You know what I'm saying? People talk about shit like this, and you never, and nigga be like, eh, if it happened, it happened. Nine times out of ten, it might not happen. Type shit. Cause you know, so many of these YouTubers and people, they're not even YouTubers this time, but a lot of these YouTubers. Be finessing the game. We don't even like to do shit. They just be talking a lot of shit and don't even do it. But turn out these niggas who really bought that shit. So I don't know how Jake Paul got. And this is the last time I probably ever talk about Jake Paul and, and Nate Robinson on my channel and about this shit. Cause this is, this is just like he 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 embarrassed the black community, bruh. I just have to say it, he embarrassed us, bruh. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not saying, I'm not trying to make it black and white, but god damn, it was black and white, <laughs> but, um, Nate Robinson, bruh, I don't know what in his right legal mind to say that, okay, I can, I'm a basketball, I'm a professional basketball player, and, you know, Jake Paul, Jake Paul, he been training, you did. Jake Paul trained for boxing. When he fought Deji and he fought all them other people. You know what I'm saying? When even even when he fought Deji, you know what I'm saying? And, and he won. I said that fight, that fight wasn't that fight wasn't that bad. You know what I'm saying? That was a good L for Deji. Bruh. Nate Robinson. I don't know what the fuck you thought you was doing, my guy. I don't know if you thought you were playing basketball and that you was about to dunk on a nigga or you were trying to play defense or something. But, my guy, you need to work on your hands and weaving, bitch. The fuck, nigga? You supposed to hit that nigga with a pop, 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 pop. You know what I'm saying? This nigga up in... This nigga... T bro, this nigga done jumped in the ring. Nigga playing cat and mouse. Nigga, nigga acting like a little squirrel. 
this nigga here, bruh, this nigga here, and, and it's crazy, because I, I, I watched a little bit of Nate Robinson, I'm not a big fan of Nate Robinson, but I watched some videos of Nate Robinson, and there's videos of Nate Robinson, he was, he was training with his kids, and he was telling his kids, he was like, man, if y'all want to be great, y'all got to train, bro, y'all got to train, y'all got to train, train, and train, and more train, which is true, and I heard that Nate Robinson was training, like, three times a week, boxing for, like, six months straight, or some bullshit like that, tell me why this nigga, this nigga Nate Robinson jumped in the ring, I guess, I guess he thought this was a hugging match, you know what I'm saying, this nigga jumped in the ring, and the first thing the nigga do was hug, hug Jake Paul, hugging this nigga, bro, when I tell you this shit was retarded, bro, I say that, Nate Robinson, my guy, man, and you know what I'm saying, I don't want karma to come back on a nigga, you know what I'm saying, because karma do come back on a nigga, but that knockout nigga, you, what the fuck was that, my guy, that nigga hit you with this, wow, what, that nigga hit that nigga with a combo maker, this nigga, lit- this nigga literally here jumped in the ring, they, man, okay, Nate Robinson find this nigga, bruh. Jake Paul up in that bitch, you know, doing his thing. Nate Robinson jump in this bitch. First thing he do, start hugging a nigga. Bruh, I don't know if he was weaving niggas. Okay, Jake Paul got that nigga. Jake Paul hit that nigga with a mean one. Nigga stumbled. Okay, the nigga stumbled. You know what I'm saying? The nigga, the nigga, this was like, okay, the first round was bad. You know what I'm saying? Cause, they, man, bro, they say Nate Robinson from the hood, bro, straight north side. You know what I'm saying? I'm a hood, Nate, straight north side. But I don't know if he was from the north side or nothing, but that nigga said they was from the hood. And it's even worse, all the motherfucking celebrities was there. Snoop Dogg was the commentator. Bro, if Snoop Dogg is the commentator and you get knocked out, bro, it's no good, my guy. This nigga, okay, it, he, the niggas, Snoop Dogg, or oh, something that bitch, he's like, yeah, pumping up Nate, pumping Nate Robinson ego up, bruh, yeah, you know, Nate Robinson, he a young hood nigga, you know what I'm saying, that nigga know how to fight, he's scrappy, you know what I'm saying, he's an NBA player, whoop the whoop that, whoop the whoop this, you know what I'm saying, okay, you know what I'm saying, he really, he really, he really hyping up the match, so this nigga been a, this nigga, Nate Robinson up in this bitch, like, this nigga Nate Robinson hugging, hugging Jay Paul, Bernie didn't know what to do, bro. Uh, Snoop Dogg like, man, this gonna be a good match, man. <laughs> bro, when when Jay Paul hit that nigga Nate Robinson with that mean ass Molly Wop, that nigga hit the nigga in the back of his head, nigga. That nigga was that nigga fell on the ground so hard. God damn, Jay Paul got Jay Paul must got. Must be mad because his other brother, um, what the fuck his uh, other br- brother name is, got beat by, um, by the other dude, KSI. That nigga said, okay, you think it's shit sweet? Okay, Nate Robinson, stop in this motherfucking ring. Nate Robinson, my guy, word of advice, my guy, you should know something that ring. You know what I'm saying? Like, that shit is embarrassing, bro. That nigga got molly whopped. That nigga got knocked on the ground. That nigga got bro. They, they thought that nigga was dead. That nigga, that nigga, that nigga, that nigga. Um, that nigga Snoop was like, "Oh my lord!" I was like, "Damn!" And then, then he said, "Then, then Snoop was like, yeah, he he don't come back from this yet. He don't get up from come back from this." Wow. Meanwhile, this nigga Nate Robinson laid out on the ground, bro. Niggas and bro, they roasted this nigga Nate Robinson in the comments talking about. Man, nigga said he was from the street. Nigga, this nigga wasn't from the street. He said, nigga said, if this was a street fight, boy, that would have been embarrassing, bro. That would have been a, a horrible street fight. But I didn't think that Nate Robinson was going to get his ass beat. I wasn't even thinking about making a video about this, about this nigga, bro. That shit crazy, man. But that's how that shit go, bro. What's up, man? Shit chilling, bro. Keep it up, man. But yeah, that's when uh, people used to sell me weed. But um, but yeah, I'm like, bro, this nigga, this nigga, this nigga Nate Robinson, 
this nigga Nate Robinson was like, do, 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 do. let me jump in this ring, let me collect the bag. Nigga, you collect the bag and a meme meme. Nigga, how you gonna, how you gonna, how you gonna jump in the, jump, jump in the, jump in the motherfucking ring, collect the bag, and be a meme meme? Bruh, his, bruh, like, they said, bruh, they was like, they was like, man, they, they, they said, when they rousing get out that bit, they be like, well, he, he can't be saying, oh, stop playing, he said he can't say this to his homeboys now, stop playing with me, boy, I'm gonna knock you, I'm gonna knock your ass up, bro, I'm gonna beat your ass, they was like, he can't say this to his homeboys now, Damn, imagine getting beat by Jake Paul. I ain't saying nothing wrong with Jake Paul. He, that nigga about what, six, six, four, six, three. Nigga built swole. But I'll, I'll whoop that nigga. You know what I'm saying? I'll, I'll fight that nigga on some real shit. On some real hood shit. But boxing and fighting is some two different things, you dig? But, um, you know what I'm saying? He's a watching the ring, watching the fight, then getting in that ring with the nigga. But Nate Robinson, bruh. How the fuck do you get knocked out? Like, you just ruined, like, you finna be the new meme or 20 to 21, bruh. Your kids, bruh. Think about your kids. This nigga's gonna have to be like, this nigga's gonna have to go around the school, town, and be like, man, yeah. They be like, they be like, man, you just watch that fight. They be like, they be like what fight? They be like, uh huh. The fight with your dad in it. Anyway, oh my goodness. He was like, yeah, that nigga got knocked out. Oh, but if that was me, I'd be like, damn. And the, the thing about it is, okay, Jake Paul is a, okay, Jake Paul is a good person to have a match with, but it's not even like a, it's not even like a, 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 a let me say it, bro. It's not even like a, a worthy fight. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, people, I'm not saying Jake Paul not a worthy opponent, but just to me, to me, that nigga had more, that nigga had more to lose taking an L than winning. You know what I'm saying? Like, okay, yeah, he won. Okay, they'd be like, oh yeah, the suspect he won, he fought his Jake Paul type shit. But nigga, you got knocked out by him. Nigga, you had more to lose than Jake Paul. Nigga, you a professional NBA player, bruh. And you just took a fat ass L like that, bruh. Like, look at, look, nigga, look at his history. Look where he, look, look, look at his background. Look at Jake Paul's background. Bro, Nick Robinson, bro, had so much to lose. Now this nigga finna be the meme meme of ever. Bro, they finna dog this nigga, bro. I didn't think, bro, word of advice, bro. Sometimes training, <laughs> if you're not built for it, if you're not built for it, and, and you train 24-7 and this nigga knock you out, bruh. I don't know, bruh. It's like, it's hard to, it's hard to come back from that, bruh. It's hard to come back from that. But, you know, Nate Robinson is a dog. He's a legend. So, he can come back from that. But, cause look, he made it to the NBA. He's only 5'8". You know what I'm saying? But, damn, man. I didn't, Nate Robinson, we, we with you, my God, but... You gotta hold that L, my guy. That that's a tough one. That that is that's a tough one, man. You you, you, you was a you was a legend almost. You you're playing it professional basketball. You talk so much shit, and it's just like, bruh, I can't believe it. You know what I'm saying? I really I really lost the words. But that's how it goes, bruh. I guess he 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 he. he, he he bit off more than he could chew, and that nigga knocked that. He knocked that nigga out. But um, um, you know what I'm saying? Fuck with your boy. If your boy ever in the fight, pray. I hope I don't get knocked out. I pray to God I don't get knocked out. I don't want to win my fights. I don't want to get knocked out. Hell, nah, not in the hood anyway. Them niggas gonna stomp your ass out. But uh, <laughs> oh. Uh, Fuck with your boy. Straight not side hood in this bitch. Bro, that shit is crazy. Uh, Nate Robinson. A major L is for a major comeback. I don't, I don't know. Um, fuck with your boy. I'm out this bit. <laughs> like, subscribe. I hope y'all like this video. I'm out this bit. Deucey. Hey, Dad. You know what I want. We link up, dog. This shit be legendary. You know this is instrumental, you the engineer on it, so Kodak everywhere.